हेलो स्टूडेंट दिस इज लक्ष्मी कदरिया वेलकम बैक इन टू डेज कंप्यूटर क्लास एंड इन दिस क्लास वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द कीबोर्ड माउस एंड टच टाइपिंग सो लेट्स स्टार्ट चैप्टर थ्री मोर अबाउट द कीबोर्ड एंड माउस कीबोर्ड एंड माउस आर द टू इम्पोर्टेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ अ कंप्यूटर You have already learned to use a keyboard and a mouse in class 1. Let us learn more about them. Keyboard. A keyboard has many buttons called keys. There are 104 keys on a standard keyboard. You can type letters, numbers and symbols with the help of these keys alphabet keys number keys arrow keys enter keys caps lock key space bar key backspace key function keys control keys shift keys delete key let us learn about alphabet keys number keys and arrow keys alphabet keys these keys are used to type letters they are marked with the english letters a to z number keys these keys are used to type numbers they are marked with numbers 0 to 9 arrow keys or cursor control keys these keys are used to control the movement of cursor on the monitor do you know the keys on a keyboard are not arranged in order from a to z they are arranged as q w e r t y and so on such keyboards are called qwerty keyboards practical in computer lab open notepad and perform the following tasks take the help of your teacher type we should never waste water using the alphabet keys press space bar key to give space between the two words press enter key now press caps lock key and type we should never waste water now press backspace key and erase never waste water and type always save water special keys there are some tasks that cannot be done by the keys you have already learned these tasks require the help of some other keys these keys are called special keys some of these keys work in combination with other keys let us learn about them caps lock key it is used to type capital letters backspace key it erases anything typed on the left side of the cursor enter key it takes the cursor to the next line it is also known as return key space bar key it is used to give space between two words it is the longest key on the keyboard control key it is used to perform special tasks along with other keys symbol keys the symbol keys have two different symbols marked on it for example the upper symbol is called upper character exclamation mark dollar plus 
and the lower symbol is called lower character. One, four, equal to. Shift key. The shift key is used to type the upper characters marked on the symbol keys. To type the upper characters, you have to first press the shift key, and while keeping it pressed, you have to press the key that has the upper character. Suppose you have to type the dollar symbol. Press the shift key first, and while keeping it pressed, press this key. You can also type capital letters using the shift key. Suppose you want to type mouse. While keeping the shift key pressed, press M key. Small m is typed as capital M. Now type other letters without pressing shift key. Remember, when you need to type only one capital letter, it is better to use shift key than caps lock key. Delete key. Delete key is used to erase anything typed on the right side of the cursor. Suppose you have typed tell Kit instead of delete. To erase the extra K, move the cursor before the letter K using arrow keys and press delete key once. Practical in computer lab. Type the table of five using notepad. Take the help of your teacher. Press shift plus asterisk to type asterisk. Function keys. Look at the top of the keyboard. You see the keys marked as F1, F2, up to F12. These keys are called function keys. They are used to perform special functions. Touch typing. Touch typing is a method to type the text on the computer without looking at the keyboard. Finger positioning on the keyboard. Sit straight in front of the computer. Put your left hand fingers on the keys A, S, D, F and right hand fingers on the keys J, K, L, semicolon in the middle row of the keyboard as shown above. Put your both thumbs on the space bar key. The two keys G and H are placed at the center of the middle row. Use left index finger to press G and right index finger to press H as shown in the picture. Remember, do not pull or push the keyboard too hard. Do not keep anything on the keyboard such as books and CDs. Practical in computer lab. Type the given text using notepad. Take the help of your teacher. Mouse. A mouse is a pointing device attached to the computer. Do you know why it is called a mouse? It looks like a mouse with a long tail. It moves quickly on the screen. It is used to point and select items on the computer screen. It is also used while playing games and making drawings. There are different types of mouse available. Two button mouse, three button mouse and scroll mouse. Let us learn about scroll mouse. Scroll mouse. A scroll mouse has a scroll wheel in the middle of left and right button. The scroll wheel helps you to move up 
and down in a page. Ball mouse. It uses. Ball inside the mouse or the movement of the mouse pointer. Optical mouse. It uses light instead of a ball for the movement of the mouse pointer. Mouse pointer. You see an arrow head on the computer screen. This arrow is called the mouse pointer. When you move the mouse on the mouse pad in any direction, the mouse pointer also moves in the same direction on the screen. Do you know there can be different shapes of mouse pointer? For example, the shape of the mouse pointer changes with different actions you do on a computer. How to click the mouse? Clicking the mouse is a very important activity. You must learn to click the mouse properly. There are two types of clicking, single click and double click. Single click. Single click means pressing the left mouse button once. It is of two types. Left click to left click. Gently press and release the left mouse button once. It is used to select an icon and give commands to the computer. For example, move the mouse pointer to start button on the desktop. Left click on it to open the start menu as shown. Right click to right click. Gently press and release the right mouse button once. It generally displays a list of commands called as right click menu or pop up menu. For example, right clicking on this PC icon on the desktop displays a pop up menu as shown. Double click. Double click means to quickly press the left mouse button twice. Practical in computer lab. With the help of your teacher, perform the following tasks. Select computer icon on the desktop. Right click on it and count the number of options in the list that appears. Now, left click anywhere away from computer icon. See that it gets deselected. Take the mouse pointer to computer icon and double click on it. Remember, keep the mouse on a mouse pad as it moves better on a smooth surface. Touch screen gestures. Finger movements called gestures are used to work on a touch screen computer. All the activities that you perform using a mouse is done by your finger on a touch screen computer. Let us learn about some of the commonly used touch screen gestures. Press and hold. To open a shortcut menu with a list of actions. It is similar to right clicking with a mouse. Swipe to move the screen in left or right direction. Scroll to move the screen upward or downward. Rotate to move the picture or other item on the screen in the circular direction. Zoom in, zoom out. To make the item on the screen smaller or larger. Our inspiration at IT. 
Christopher Scholes invented the QWERTY typewriter. The computer keyboard is designed in the same way. Douglas Engelbart invented the computer mouse.